Hey guys, I'm here with the new LEGO Batman construction figure, which LEGO sent to me early to review, but of course all thoughts are my own. The set has 275 pieces and stands 10 and a half inches tall with posable shoulders, elbows, hips, thighs, knees, ankles, wrists, fingers, and a posable neck. Look, I don't care for these figures, but I gotta say, it's probably my favorite set in this style. Something about the nearly monotone color helps hide the gaps for me, and the giant cape on the back is really nice quality and definitely brings some points to the table. This is based off of Michael Keaton's 1989 Batman, and while I do think this set is mostly good, it does fall into the same issue that the Iron Man figure had in 2021, that there's nobody for him to fight against. Technically, that's still true for Marvel since they haven't made a villain at this scale, but I struggle to think how adventurous this toy could be to a kid's imagination when there's nobody in the DC Universe to have him team him up with or fight against. Still, it'll set you back $35 or $30 bucks, somewhere in that neighborhood to get this figure, and for another 30 or 35 you could get any of the marvel figures for him to team up against but by that time you'll have spent 70 bucks plus tax to get two of these lego sets when you could have had three marvel legends or a few mcfarland dc action figures or a smaller number of lego sets that would get you more mini figures to play with so i just think that it's a strange scale at the price and i think that there's better ways to spend your money if you're into action figures and lego I'm told these are really popular with kids and pretty good sellers at the Lego store by a friend of mine that works at the New York store, and I'm really happy for those that buy these and enjoy them, but as an adult collector, the logic behind these doesn't really fit in with what I enjoy collecting when it comes to Lego, and I can't really say I recommend them over any other set currently offered in the same price range. As always, I'd love to hear what you guys think, so drop a comment below, hit like and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys on the next video. Well, you made it to the end of the video. Thanks for hanging out with me today, and don't forget to hit like and subscribe, and maybe check out one of my other videos listed here.